bookmark an oval pattern hello friends pick stitch brings you another simple and beautiful tatting pattern basic requirements as usual cotton yarn shuttle and a scissor here you can see it's an oval pattern made of two types of ring larger ring which is attached with a smaller ring without without chain we'll start with large ring first ring 1 3 double stitch one picot three double stitch now we'll make three picots now three double stitches one picot three double stitches pull yarn to complete the ring in this way we have made our first string Now, now we'll start with second ring, the smaller ring. We have to leave small thread, um, approximately one centimeter thread, and we'll start making second ring. Second ring, two double stitch. Picot. Again, two double stitch. One picot. Two double stitch pull yarn to complete the smaller ring similarly we'll make six larger rings and five smaller rings now we'll make large ring again we will leave one centimeter thread and then make uh, the large ring similar as uh, we had done earlier after three double stitch we'll join it with picot large ring is joined to large uh, ring and smaller to smaller ones Now pull thread to complete the third ring and now you can see how it looks. Now we will be making the smaller uh, ring and we will join it to the smaller ring. Leave one centimeter thread and start making ring two double stitch. Join the picot of the smaller rings. Two double stitch, one picot, 
and two double stitches pull thread to complete the second ring in this fashion we will we'll continue making six large rings and five small rings after six rings After six large rings, in order to make oval pattern, we will skip one small ring and will make seventh large ring and will join it to sixth ring. As earlier we had done, same way we will make uh, seventh ring, but this time we won't be leaving one centimeter thread as we are joining it to large ring three double stitch join we won't join it to smaller one we'll join it to larger rings we got now three double stitches and three picots again three double stitches one picot and three double stitches Pull yarn and in this way we completed seventh ring. So you can see the curve has started, the curve has changed, and now we'll be able to make oval pattern. Now we'll make the small ring, and in this way we'll continue making other rings. Now we'll make small ring and in this way we will continue making rings. There are total 11 number of small rings and 13 large rings. If you don't know how to, to make double stitch or picots, you can go back to earlier lessons where uh, you can learn uh, how to make simple patterns after you have completed making 10 small ring uh, we'll now make 11th ring smaller ring and we'll join it to first and 10th smaller ring to complete the inner over uh, oval shape Similarly, we will make large ring and join it uh, to complete the outer hole. Now you can see the oval pattern is ready and you can add uh, dangle to use it as bookmark. Uh, We'll leave some thread and we'll make two large rings. The three double stitch, one picot, three double stitch, and three picots. Again, three double stitch, one picot, and three double stitch. After completing first ring, we'll make second ring, and we'll join the 
join it to the first string joined angle to the oval shape and your beautiful bookmark is ready you can either gift it to someone or you can use it steps and abbreviation for your reference Thank you for watching, keep tatting, subscribe for more.